Hi, my name is uh, Luigi Colombo from Texas Instruments, and uh, I'm here from uh, the United States. Um, I guess the, the next section is really to uh, celebrate the past and, and uh, go into the, into the future. The past was a lot of uh, graphene prints, uh, a lot of publications on, on graphene. I think that the future is a combination of uh, the new 2D materials called cogenides and, and so forth, including uh, graphene. And so there will be uh, uh, many opportunities to publish uh, new works, uh, both fundamental as, as well as applied. And so I think there's a, a great opportunity for the publishing companies to establish a, a continued relationship with uh, the, uh, the scientists across the board and, uh, and, uh, to, uh, and to ensure that uh, the, the new information is published in a, in a timely fashion and effectively perform a technology transfer real time uh, across Europe and, and even the, the world. Uh, and so uh, we believe that this is really uh, critical uh, for the success of uh, uh, 2D materials in, in general and also for the success of the technology development uh, uh, across Europe and, and, and elsewhere. Uh, so the, the objective of this session is to uh, continue and, and encourage uh, people to uh, uh, publish in, in these journals and also to have the, uh, the publishing companies uh, communicate uh, to the scientists, the students and, and postdocs uh, what they uh, would like to see and, and uh, how to uh, perhaps uh, minimize or decrease uh, the, uh, the activation energy for publication because we all s sometimes uh, have uh, issues in, 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 these, in, in getting our papers published and so it would be nice for the, uh, the, the publishing companies, the representatives, to tell us how to improve our papers, how to improve the process and uh, how to uh, uh, basically create better papers and, and so forth. That's it.